Hey guys, it's Rob. This is the Armatan uh, VTAL 355. I've got the HQ 8x4.5 multi rotor propellers on it, and I've got May May Day's uh, custom mix on the tail. I've just taken it for a fly, and it does fly really nicely. I think the um, the yaw is a little bit smoother when you start and stop than it was previously, but uh, yeah, it's flying very well. So I'll just give you a quick demonstration. I get this hat cam on at the right angle. Let's go. Acro mode. It's a nice calm day today, so uh, you'll see any little vibrations or oscillations in the quad. Uh, very easy. It'll just be the quad itself, not any wind, because there's no wind at the moment. So. Yeah, really, not really nice. I think where I've noticed uh, the most difference with uh, the custom mix is just when I do your. I'll just put it into self-level mode and just show you. Yeah, it just seems to um, go in and out of that yaw a bit smoother than it was before. Sorry, I'm just getting really annoyed by a lot of flies. <laughs> I'll concentrate on my flying. Back into acro mode. Those lights are really distracting too. Definitely flying very well. Yeah, I think uh, with those rolls and the flip, it just seems to uh, come out very, very smoothly. But it's such a nice quad to fly, lots of fun. And I never feel like I'm going to get disoriented with this one. I do with the small X quads when I fly uh, too far away, but with this one it's just much easier. It's a lot more like flying a, a proper radio controlled aeroplane, I think. Yeah, it just feels like more, a lot more like an aeroplane flying fast like that. Alrighty, that's almost the four minutes, so I'll just go back to the concrete to land. The grass is just a bit too long for this VTAL, it uh, hits the rear propellers. But that's hands off, just in uh, manual mode, look how stable it is. Uh, the batteries, oop, the battery just died. <laughs> Burning through batteries a lot quicker, maybe I need some new batteries. That normally goes quite easily for four minutes. Anyway, thanks for watching.